A sailor's recovering tonight after he was forced to swim for his life. Geoffrey Hunter had to swim three kilometres in rough seas to survive. The life jacket that saved a grandfather now covered in blood. He's got a heart problem and, and, and he was probably very lucky to make it. Yeah. Jeff Hunter fell off his yacht when it was hit by a wave off the Bunbury coast. He then endured three hours in the ocean, swimming three kilometres to shore. On the ocean side, there's a lot of uh, rocky wall along there, and then he, he swam ashore, and uh, as he's climbing onto the rocks, he's got himself cut up pretty bad. The last thing he left behind on his way. This morning, Jeff Hunter's mate collected his belongings from the yacht as the 62-year-old was treated in hospital for hypothermia. Because he's had a lot of experience in yachts, and I thought he, he, he just doesn't get lost, you know. Jeff Hunter was sailing from Mandra after a three day journey from Perth. He fell overboard about two yesterday afternoon. When Jeff Hunter reached land, he climbed up some rocks on the Bunbury groin but became trapped behind a fence. He managed to catch the attention of a couple fishing nearby. They called a local dive shop owner who cut a hole in the fence and helped him to safety. Bunbury Sea Rescue's Albert Fullerton says there's two rules sailors should stick to. For their own safety, a life jacket and, and tie themselves on. Geoffrey Hunter's daughter Leanne says the ordeal hasn't put her dad off sailing. Estelle Lewis, Nine News.